I was just kind of wondering, and, and y'all kind of got on in a little bit, in, a little bit in that last conversation as to why, like, you know, you said something earlier about having the Ten Commandments everywhere, and then you said something just now about being offended when somebody says "God bless you." Um, a little bit. I'll just <clears throat> guess. I'm wondering why uh, the Christian face or, or, or any face, because I guess atheism actually is a, a lack thereof. Why do they offend you? Because coming from the standpoint of a Christian, like y'all being, you, you choosing to be an atheist doesn't offend me in any way, really. Are, are you a Christian? Yes, sir. And, uh, okay, uh, I don't want to put you on the spot, but could you tell me, please, what you think is going to happen to my soul after I die? Um. That's not up to me. I'm not ask, no, I'm not asking you to, to, uh, to pass judgment on me, right? I'm an atheist. Let's suppose I'm still an atheist when I die. According to, the, to what's, in your, what's taught in your religion, what happens to me? Uh, like I said, I, you know, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm you don't not, know? I'm not there yet. That's bizarre because we atheists are not even members of your religion, and we know what the teachings of your religion are. You know what the teachings are, but um, you're saying my religion. However, there are different beliefs with Christianity inside of Christianity. So with you, so, all everything right. Else. I, I hate to have to do this because I don't like putting words in people's mouths. But <laughs> since you're refusing to, you know, just um, fess up to what the teachings of your own religion are, I'll tell you what your religion says happens to me, right? What what happens to me is I get tortured forever, right? According to the rules of your religion, if I'm still an atheist when I die, I go to hell forever, right? Okay, yeah. Yes, okay. And you are a member of that religion. At some point, somebody told you, that that is what happens to people who aren't members of your, of your religion, and you're okay with that. That's why I'm upset with Christians. That's why, why I get upset because, when because. Christians say when Christians say things like they'll pray for me, right? Because you are a bunch of people who think I deserve to be tortured forever. Don't How am I supposed to not that. be upset, huh? I don't think you deserve that. You don't think According I deserve it? But you worship the God that you believe is going to do that to me. If you don't think hey. I deserve that, stop worshiping that God. Hey, why are you getting upset about something that's mythological? That's, that's what the point I'm if trying you, to get at. If you told me that you believed I deserved um, to, be, to be imprisoned for life on, in a penal col colony on Jupiter... There's no such Mount thing. Mordor. There's no <laughs> such thing as a penal colony on on Jupiter, but you're expressing the sentiment that I deserve to be incarcerated forever. Okay? I can react to that. I'm perfectly within my rights to resent your attitude about me, even if your attitude ultimately connects up with something that's a fiction. You're still going around, you're still voluntarily being a member of a religion that condemns me to eternal torment just for not being a member. That's why. See, there you go again, calling it religion and, and yet you don't believe in it. Well, see, I'm not trying No, to, I don't think I'm, I'm not, going to hell, sir, but you do. I'm not trying You to. do, and not only that, you're in favor of it. You're staying in the religion that says that that's, what's gonna, that, that's what I deserve. That you asked what you called and asked why we get upset about Christians. That's why. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm trying to figure out why. I mean, uh, uh, because if somebody walking down the street, uh -huh. whatever, says something to me, yeah. or somebody says they don't like me, I'm an asshole or whatever, that's fine. I, I really don't care. No, no. I, really? I do hey, care. Hey, you're an asshole is way less of an insult than you deserve to be tortured forever. That's true. That is and, not on the same scale. And even not on the same scale. <laughs> but most, it's people, most people... Huh? But it's something to you that doesn't exist. That'd be like telling me that I needed to go live in Candyland or something, you know? Like... Uh, uh, in a sense, I think you're already living in Candyland. 
I mean, I just don't understand why, you know, you feel the need to tear down somebody else and they're not tearing you down. You are tearing me down. You're in a religion that says I deserve to be tortured forever, voluntarily. If you don't think I deserve that, quit the religion. It's very simple. They don't think you very deserve Very simple. Huh? They're not saying you deserve that. But you're worshiping the God that you think is going to do that to me. <clears throat> You go think about that. Clearly, by your own, by your clearly own. Clearly, you need to think about this a little bit more. That's by your own decision. So what? That's like that's like I'm a hunter, so a deer that's in the woods deserves to get killed. That's not the same thing. If you are a hunter, then on some level you must believe that, wouldn't you? I mean, you know, if you came after me, what, with a what gun, are you doing I'd hunting things you don't think deserve thing. to get killed? I don't think they deserve to get killed. You don't stop I'm killing them. <laughs> What's well, wrong with you? Them. I don't understand why you're getting so upset about it, you know? That's what uh, actually, I, I mean, that's, You know what? what? And the fact that you don't get it, the fact that you don't get it, is more reason for me to be upset. You are part of, in my opinion, an evil cult an evil that cult? wants the worst possible things to happen to me. All right? Now you go, uh, well, go away and think about that. I think we better move on to our next caller. <laughs> Yeah. If you want to... Yeah, if the you Christian email, love is just fun. flowing out of the telephone. <laughs> I, I think you upset him, actually. But <laughs> I, I couldn't tell for sure. Um, but um, I don't know. I'm not that offended by, Christi by Christians. I think most of them don't really think about well, those implications you know, I don't, very much. I don't go around don't stewing about this all yeah, the time no. either. You know, I, I let it out I when we have I know you Christians. well enough, Jeff, that that was not I, you angry. That was you having fun. I, I right? let it out on <laughs> Christian callers because yeah. I think that... Um, ultimately, most Christians are actually perfectly nice people that if they were able to stop and think for five seconds about the implications yeah. of their own belief system, they'd stop believing it. Right. I mean... That's uh, why. And I think, and I think it's an emotional appeal I'm making, right? I'm not making a rational argument here. I'm saying, well, if you don't think this is right, stop doing it, right? Uh, and emotional appeals are best made... You know, forcefully. <laughs> <laughs>